Guys, I'm getting a dog. I am so excited. I am getting like hot flashes. <laughs> I am getting a little puppy. By the time this video goes up, I will be getting her in five days. So hopefully the video after this will be the vlog of me getting her. If not, then the video after that. But yeah, I am getting a puppy and I'm so excited. She is a little shorky. I'll insert a picture of her right here. I decided to name her Nova. It just kind of came to me one day and I really love that name, so... I thought why not and it's a cute name for a little puppy. In this video I am going to be showing you guys all of the things that I bought for her in preparation, all the essentials and some things that aren't super essential but I thought were cute that I would get for her. I'm talking so fast because I am so excited. <laughs> I'm also going to try my best to link everything in this video down in the description box below. If you are also a new puppy owner or you just see something you like that you want to get for your dog so yeah i'll try my best the first thing i got for nova is this little puff um <laughs> it doesn't look that little on camera but it is this is actually from ikea which i was surprised i didn't know ikea sold pet accessories so yeah this isn't going to be her dog bed or anything like that when i pick her up she is going to have her dog bed with her already but I thought this would be a cute thing to have for her and put in the living room or in the office or like in my bedroom so she can have something to lay on if she wants and just lounge on. So yeah, I got her this Tropiclean Luxury 2-in-1 Pet Shampoo and Conditioner. I've heard so many great things about this brand in particular and um, this smells incredible. It's papaya and coconut. It smells like a pina colada and that doesn't make sense because pina coladas are pineapple and coconut but it smells amazing. I got this off of Amazon. Everything I got was either from Amazon or from a local pet store and Etsy. So yeah, this was from Amazon. Also from Amazon, I got her this hairbrush, double side <laughs> brush for brushing, no way. <laughs> I got her this grooming kit. I am going to be attempting to groom her myself. I've watched so many videos on YouTube of little puppies getting groomed and it's so cute. And I'm gonna try myself. Grooming can get expensive and especially for a hypoallergenic puppy or dog in general, they need to be groomed a lot more often than dogs who shed. So I thought I would learn and try my best to do it myself, but this kit is really great. It comes with a comb. Um, this is what I'm really excited for. They're scissors that are curved. I don't know if you can tell. Yeah, but they're curved, which will really help round out their face and head. Just some regular shears. Are these called shears? And then last but not least, we've got some thinning scissors. <laughs> um, but yeah, it was a great kit. It had everything I needed and it comes in a nice little compact pouch to keep it all nice and clean. So yeah, watch out for a video later on when I attempt to groom her myself. Also, along the lines of grooming, I of course got her some nail trimmers. Um, this one has a safety guard on it as well um, to prevent injury. I'm. This is probably the thing that I'm most nervous about to do um, is trimming her nails. Next up, I got her this oral care kit. It comes with a toothbrush. This is a finger brush so you can just put it on your finger and go straight into her mouth. Um, and some cleaning gel. Doing a little bit more research, this gel isn't the best thing for dogs, but it is usable. But I think eventually I'll just make my own homemade toothpaste that's safe for dogs so I know what is exactly in it. On the lines of dental care, I got her these Greenies dental treats. You've probably seen these everywhere. I got her the teeny weeny size and I already opened this because I was curious as to how small they actually are. Oh, also, this is just me being stupid probably. 
definitely. I was just stupid, but for some reason, I was thinking dental treats. They're in a green box. It fights bad breath and dental care. I thought they were gonna smell minty for some reason. They don't smell minty. <laughs> this is how teeny tiny they are. It's so cute. But yeah, they definitely, oof, they do not smell minty. Next up, I got this Nature's Miracle Scented Enzymatic Formula Stain and Odor Remover. With a new puppy, you know, accidents are bound to happen. I am hopefully prepared. I am going to try to house train her, so using um, training pads, but I also want her to go outside, so... Yeah, there's bound for accidents to happen, but this I've heard really great things about. It's really important that you get the enzymatic formula. That way it completely removes the odor to dogs. Even if you can't smell it, they can still. So yeah, this is in the lavender scent. I also got her some training puppy pads. They are the extra big ones. We'll see how this goes. I've heard mixed things about dogs either trying to eat these or chewing them up and it just doesn't work for them but i'm gonna try my best to train her to go indoors but of course i'm gonna be taking her out as well but yeah just an extra precaution a lot of poop bags dogs poop let's face it and this is just the amazon brand they were a really great deal i don't even remember how many bags this is i think it was like 860 bags um it also came with this little holder that you can hook onto your leash which is perfect um and it smells like cucumber weird but i guess good so yeah i am definitely prepared for a really long time i got her a crate as well this was actually my uncle's old crate for his dog that he doesn't have anymore. I am going to try my best to crate train her. I just think it's the safest option for puppies to keep them safe, keep them secure when you're sleeping. And I also got her a playpen. I've watched so many dog training videos and every single one of them recommends a playpen. So I went ahead and ordered one off of Amazon and it is huge. I was not expecting it to be so big, but yeah, it's a really great, it's really great quality for how much it was. So yeah, hopefully she likes that and it works out. Let's talk about treats. I have two bags of treats so far um, because I am going to start training her right away. The perfect time to start socialization and um, training is within the 8 to 12 weeks that they are alive. They are just super impressionable at that age. So yeah, I made sure to have treats right away. The first thing I got was the Zooks Mini Naturals Duck Recipe. I've heard so many great things about the Zooks brand. These are a little moist as well, so um, these are a really great medium level treat. And they've got pretty simple ingredients as well, which is really good. So yeah, I got her a duck recipe. And then I got her the Crumbs Naturals Mini Trainers. These are just freeze-dried beef liver. Um, I really want to try my best to um, feed her a really healthy diet and just like one ingredient protein treats are perfect for that So yeah, these are the two I got do not smell them I already opened them because I was curious and I have to smell everything Don't smell it <laughs> Speaking of treats and food um, Nova is going to be coming with a little bag of the food that she's on right now but eventually I am going to be transitioning her into a fresh food and raw food diet. Um, I've done a whole lot of research and that just seems and proves to be the best diet for dogs. It's biologically correct and appropriate. So eventually I am going to transition her to that. No tea, no shade to dog owners who feed kibble. There's really high quality kibbles out there as well, but there's also really bad kibble that is just full of fillers um 
So yeah, personally, I am going to be feeding Nova a fresh and raw diet. But yeah, I don't have that right now. I will eventually be picking that up as we get closer to the day that she comes home. Next up, we have toys. I got this off of Amazon. It was a pretty good deal for how many toys you get. Um, I wanted a variety just because I don't know what she likes yet. It comes with this cow plush toy. How adorable is this? And it's got a squeaker as well. So yeah, I thought this was really cute. And it comes with another plush toy. I guess this is some kind of chicken, turkey, I don't know, <laughs> some kind of meat. But it also has a squeaker. Um, and these look like they are really great quality as well. Like they won't tear too easily, but of course I'm gonna keep an eye on her just to make sure she stays safe with these. Comes with a donut, so cute. Also a squeaker. Um, and then this is a little rope toy with a ball on the end so we can play tug of war. This is two balls on one side, another tug of war, and then two more rope toys. I heard these are really great for teething, something to chew on. Um, I'd love to teach her how to play fetch. So yeah, this was a really great deal on Amazon if you're looking for a variety of toys for your pup. Literally every single dog training video I've ever watched has talked about these bad boys. If you don't know what these are, they look kind of funny, but if you don't know what these are, these are Kongs. Um, basically, it's a chew toy that you can put food inside and you can, or food, treats, things like that, and you can actually freeze it and then give it to your dog and basically it's an interactive toy like they have to try to get all the food out this is going to keep them super busy if you have like to do the dishes or make dinner or something you can just give them one of these and it'll keep them busy for a long time especially if you freeze them but yeah i've heard such great things so i got two this one is the puppy one so it's a little bit of a softer material while they teeth and then this red one is the classic so this is for when she's got all her adult teeth and stuff like that it's a little bit harder but i was not expecting them to be so tiny but they are so cute um they come in a lot of different sizes as well this is the small for dogs up to 20 pounds and she's not going to be 20 pounds so this is perfect but yeah super cute and i'm really excited to give her these. Then I also got her a leash. I got her this one off of Amazon. It's really great quality. I definitely will link this one down below. Um, and it wasn't that expensive either, but this is gray and it's got a cushiony material on the inside that's teal. This is a standard six feet, six foot leash and it also has a handle here closer to where your dog will hook on just in case you have to really hold them back from something but yeah i'm really happy with this one this water bottle um a little extra but i think it's essential especially if you're planning on taking your dogs on really long walks or hikes or things like that but I got this off of Amazon. Um, this fills with water and then you can control the flow. There is a hole in this bowl and you can control the flow and kind of pour it out and then your dog drinks from it from here. And then this bottom part has room for treats. If you want to train your dog outdoors, that's really important to socialize them properly um, or even food if you're going on a long trip. And then we have some accessories. I am so excited about these. The first thing I got for her is this collar. She is getting another collar in the mail soon as well, but this is the Martingale style where there's no buckle, but you control it by these rings and then you slip it over the head. 
Um, I've heard good things about both a buckle style and a martingale style, so I've got both. This is a martingale style. The buckle one will be coming shortly. I don't have it right now, but maybe in a future vlog you will see that. But yeah, it is such a cute print as well. It is this mustard floral print that I am obsessed with. You will see how obsessed I am. But this is from a local Etsy shop in my city. So yeah, I thought why not support a small business and it was really cute. And from that same Etsy shop, I got the matching leash. I know, super extra, but how adorable is this? Like, come on, that is so cute. This is also a six feet leash. <laughs> yeah, six feet leash, super cute, super matching set. And if you think I am done with this print, you are sadly mistaken. From a different um, Canadian small business on Etsy, I ordered her, her first bandanas and they just came today. I just closed the window so hopefully you can't hear it as loudly as before so sorry about that but I got her this bandana you guys I am crazy but how adorable is that I can't it is so tiny and cute but it is from another Canadian small business on Etsy I'll have it linked down below if you're interested but yeah I just I love this print so much. I just love mustard and yellow. Mustard and yellow. <laughs> I love mustard in general. And what's really nice about this is it is reversible. So on this side, it's white with gold arrows, which is also really cute. Um, and you know, you get two bandanas in one essentially for one price, which I thought was really great. I also got another one from the same Etsy shop. This is a gray floral, super cute. And then on this side, it's pink with white polka dots. So yeah, now Nova has four bandanas basically. Super cute, I'm so excited. I got her a little name tag or name ID. This was also from a Canadian small business on Etsy, but it is this super adorable gold yeah it is this gold pet id and then on the back it's got my phone number which i will not show for obvious reasons sorry i look like this it's another day i was just about to upload this video and then a package came for me from my boyfriend and his family so I just wanted to include it into this video really quick, so please ignore all of this. <laughs> but um, my boyfriend and his parents picked out a couple things for Nova and sent them to me as a surprise. So thank you so much. I am super surprised. I wasn't expecting this at all. But yeah, I'm just going to show you guys what else Nova got. So they got her a carrot plush toy with a squeaker. So cute. I love it and then this is a little collar it is teeny tiny but she's gonna be so small and it is adjustable as well to make it bigger and it's a buckle which is perfect because I don't have one of these yet so that's perfect and then a bag of treats a really big bag of treats this is from Crumps Naturals it's the same brand that I got the beef liver treats from um, but these are chicken, which is good. So now I have chicken, beef, and duck so we can see what Nova likes. But this is going to be perfect to start training her. So thank you so much to Manov and his parents. It really means a lot to me. And after editing this video, I also realized I forgot to mention some other things I got for her. Dog bowls. Of course I got her dog bowls because how is she going to eat? These are from Ikea and they are so teeny tiny. Online I was not expecting them to be this small but when I saw them in person they were so small <laughs> but they're perfect sizes for her. I think these are 10 ounces at least for when she's a puppy. This is perfect but I got her a pink and a white so yeah super cute. 
and that is all <laughs> that is everything that i got for my puppy so far i hope you guys enjoyed this video i am so excited for her to finally be home so be sure to be subscribed and watch out for that video of me bringing her home and you get to finally meet her you can also follow her on instagram i already made her one um but that is where i will be keeping everyone updated with how she's doing all the tricks she's learning everything so if you want a daily dose of cuteness you can follow her at nova.theshorky but yeah that is it i hope you guys enjoy this video don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it let me know down in the comments what other videos you want to see with nova or any videos in general and please subscribe for a new video every wednesday but until then i'll see you guys next time